welcome back to my channel i'm so glad to be back with you guys it's been a little minute i was just enjoying my summer i just got back from baltimore actually a couple of days ago but yeah it's july 16th i actually start work on monday it's friday july 16th i start work on monday so i decided that i probably needed to go ahead and shoot all the stuff that i've been making so far um but yeah, if you're new, my name is Stephanie. I'll be going into my fourth year of teaching this year. And if you follow me over on Instagram, right here at everydayeducator underscore, you probably already know. I have been a seventh grade ELA special education teacher for the past three years. But this year, I will be a grade four ELA and social studies teacher. And I am uber, like uber excited y'all because it's something new i have been wanting to get into elementary school and yeah i feel like this is a good fit so what this video is about is all the stuff that i've been making with my computer on powerpoint or that i bought from tpt a lot of inspiration has come from teacher grammars on here i bought some things from Shakira Janice on Instagram and YouTube. And then I bought some things from the Texas teacher, I think Casey Taylor off of TPT. And then I've made some things as well. So let me start showing you. And also I have to, I still have to eliminate a couple of things. I still have to, and then I have a lot. This entire thing is stuff that I have to cut. So I'm gonna cut something like letters I'm going to cut but then I'm gonna wait until I get into the building next week to use my paper cutter because it's in storage and I honestly don't know where it's in storage so I'm just gonna wait until I unpack and then I'll cut like the other stuff so let's get started okay so first I'm gonna show you the things that I've already laminated so I actually recently found Haley Teaches um, Instagram and her YouTube channel and she has her classroom jobs in this format um, but they weren't on her wow that's a clear um, but they weren't on her TPT so um, I kind of just mimicked what I could from what she showed and then I'm super excited about this no it's not this one about this one down here at the bottom secret student and I plan on using it as like a classroom management type thing um i will i'm either gonna do the wheel i don't know what the website is but there's like a website where you can do like a wheel and you put in like names or whatever and i'm gonna put in my students names and then what whoever it lands on that'll be the secret obviously they won't know um we won't reveal it until the end of the day um so i'll just be like enforcing oh my secret student is doing so well with how they're sitting in line or my secret student did such a great job turning in their paper quietly stuff like that and they'll get a prize um or maybe like points on dojo if i'm using dojo i'm not sure i haven't used it in middle school um so i don't know but yeah i'm super excited about these classroom jobs and then i printed out the numbers to stick on here I do have velcro dots so I'm just gonna stick it on there I am switching so I have a co-teacher with math and science and so we'll switch like halfway throughout the day I'm gonna have to print either a second set of these so I can have block one and block two I don't really know let me know down below if you like switch with another teacher how do you do your classroom jobs with like numbers because I honestly haven't really figured out the logistics should I like print out two sets of 30? Because I don't have a roster or anything yet. Because my, it, that's a whole nother thing. <laughs> but the HR process has been so long. Like there's been delays and your girl's been irritated, but it's okay. But um, yeah, let me know down below what you think. So those are the classroom jobs. And then these are, these letters here just spell out classroom, class jobs, so probably gonna cut that with you guys okay the numbers and the actual jobs probably in the building with my paper cutter and then I made schedule cards 
because I do have my schedule on principal did send me the schedule. I hope it doesn't change because she sent me the schedule from last year, but it's okay. If it does change, it's just a quick fix. I did make these myself. Um, the fonts are AG. I don't know which fonts they are. I'll have to look back at my file and see. Um, but my colors for this year are... Can you see that? These are the time cards. There we go. These are the time cards and I'll just have, I bought magnet strips, I think is what they're called. So I just plan on cutting and uh, doing them magnetically to my whiteboard. So there's that. I think they're so cute and simple and easy to read. So there's those. And then these are, well, I think I said her name wrong at the beginning. Her name is Casey Travis. I think it's like Casey Taylor. Who is Taylor? I don't know. Um, but I bought these for my teacher toolbox from TPT. I will definitely link them down below. They are editable. Edible? Editable. Mmm. You know what I mean. Um, they are editable. She leaves. Can you see that? Space down at the bottom for you to fix in PowerPoint and label whatever you want. But she came up with a lot. So I doubt I'm going to have to create my own custom labels yeah there's four pages so there's that I will cut those at school as well and then I got well I made this just on PowerPoint uh, just as you will need and then I printed um, these supply cards that I will cut out with you guys today um, these are from the Texas teacher over on TPT. Um, so these will just go on my whiteboard and I will, um, you know, switch it out and let the kids know what they need every day. So, and you know, some kids, when I was teaching in middle school, especially, I had to repeat things a gazillion and 53 times. And I feel like I'm still gonna have to do that, but at least I'll have like a visual up on the board. So instead of repeating it, I just say look at the board, you know? So, I'll cut these with you guys. And thinking, I bought these from TBT from Shakira Janice. They're um, social emotional learning alphabet. That glare is something crazy. So, each letter has. <laughs> Morty. Morty just had to let you guys know that he was here. So. There's that. Um, but yeah, I really like them and they go with, oh, I never told you guys my colors. So if you look back at my videos, I did a classroom tour and my colors were like black and white with wood and greenery. I'm doing the exact same thing this year, but I'm incorporating more browns into it. That's why my schedule cards have that tannish, peaches, peaches, peachish color on there so yeah definitely stay tuned for classroom setup videos series and my classroom tour so i guess morty wants to say hi morty say hi no okay that's fine it's totally fine okay so i also bought from tiffany gannon her modern play decor set um I didn't use everything in there. I'm probably gonna use some more, but I only printed off her calendar. So I do have a pocket chart for my calendar. And then she has like the holidays or like last day of school, first day of school. Testing. No school. And I'll link hers down below it as well cut these in the classroom and then another thing that I bought from her before I found out I was teaching fourth grade I was supposed to be doing um reading writing and math special ed so I print out this number line and I sent this in the calendar in the SEO um 
alphabet to office depot to have to print on cardstock um but since i'm not teaching math anymore i'm not really sure how i could use the number line i kind of still want to incorporate it since i paid to have them printed so y'all let me know how i can incorporate that into a fourth grade italy and social studies class <laughs> because i honestly have zero idea but i like this is nice and i don't want it to go to waste so let me know down below please so that's pretty much it for the things that i've already laminated what i do still have to laminate on my affirmation signs that i'm gonna put on my mirror i just printed these off of I made them and printed them off of PowerPoint, so I'm going to stick these in my handy dandy laminator. I have the Scotch brand laminator. Um, I think I got it from Target last summer. Yeah, I think I got it from Target last summer. Don't know how much it costs, but I'm sure it was inexpensive. Oh, all of this, most of this stuff, like these affirmation cards, um, the teacher toolbox label, the classroom jobs, the supply labels, and my schedule cards all were printed by my printer at home. I have HP Instant Ink and I do have a code that I'll link down below so that you can get a free month and I can get a free month. I have the $3.99 subscription. I've had it since I want to say September of last year and hasn't done me wrong yet and I think it's a really great investment so uh, go on down there and sign up so we can get three months because your girl is broke. Well I ain't broke but I'm a teacher and you know if you know you know so there's that. Um, so yeah I'm going to oh I, then I have a few labels like to label my bin. I have the Sterilite bins with supplies in there and then I have a board a tin drawer cart that I am going to label the days of the week um, extra copies morning work to be graded miscellaneous and then this is just spelled out writing I'm gonna put somewhere in my classroom I don't even know if I'm gonna use it but I printed it so it's there so I'm gonna laminate these things quickly and then we'll put it to cut Okay, so I finished all of the laminating that I'm going to do for today and now I'm going to go get me some water, find something on probably Netflix, maybe Hulu, mm, I don't know, find something I'm going to watch and get to cut. So my camera died, so I'm going to show you guys the finished products. I cut out all this um, supply icons, I cut out class jobs, and the time circles for my schedule cards. And I think that's it that I'm going to cut for today. Um, so I did just get a notification that I got some deliveries at my mailbox. I did, got an Amazon package of the Velcro dots. and the magnetic dots 
and oh white cardstock so I just got that that came to my door but the other two packages from Etsy went to my mailbox so I'm gonna take Morty on a walk to the mailbox and I will show you guys what I got Shout out to Naturally Chic Shop on Etsy. I got the Devil and Black shirt. Oh, it's so cute. So cute. So I started teaching in 2018. So cute. Love it. And then there's a cute little message on the back. This is a lanyard. So cute and simple. Has my name. And that was from Suzanne Burdine from Etsy. So cute. And it matches the aesthetic of my room. Yay! I'm gonna end up this video. Thank you so much. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for my costume setup videos coming soon to a YouTube near you. <laughs> and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.